has issued a curfew tonight ahead of planned protests in the city. Now, protests have erupted all across the country after the shooting death of Walter Wallace Jr. by police in Philadelphia on Monday. Wallace, who police said was armed with a knife, was shot dead after officers fired 14 rounds. Police have said the two officers fired after Wallace ignored orders to drop a knife. CBS 17's Nick Sturdivant is live near the Oakwood neighborhood where tonight's protest is expected to happen. And Nick, you spoke with neighbors and also Mayor Ar Marianne Baldwin ahead of it all. What did they have to say? Well, you guys, we are set up right across the street from Lavelle Moulton Park, where that protest is expected to happen. Now, we spoke with uh, a few people that live in this neighborhood. They told me that they are not concerned. However, Mayor Baldwin said she is concerned. Now, this protest is planned for 730 tonight. She called the protest troubling. She also told me the city received intel this morning, which prompted the curfew. She did not go into too many details about it, but shared with me that protesters have been asked to wear black and that the messaging is a night of mischief. Mayor Baldwin said the city is preparing for the worst. Well, you know, our downtown was really took a huge hit in, in May and is still trying to recover. Um, I reluctantly called this curfew because every time we do, it impacts our small businesses. And that's not something we can afford to continue to do. And you guys, since we got to this neighborhood, we noticed police patrolling the area. Now, the curfew starts at 10 o'clock tonight. It ends at 5 a.m. tomorrow in Raleigh. Nick Sturdivant, CBS 17 News.